I don't know if we really reach your expectations, but we are so happy that we are doing this and we are transforming the lives of people, yes. I get to see my dream come true. I get to see those people's lives change. Like seeing them, it's like seeing me when I was little, when I was young, without any hope, without any, any dream, without anything to come. I've worked in the hospitals and all I, I knew was getting an injection, giving out drugs, but then I'm not transforming the, the mind. I'm not transforming people through spiritually, but I thank you, I thank ICM for bringing the Transform program to Uganda, because I see a lot of change. Whenever I see a tip it up, I say, okay, BBT ICM has visited that, that, that home. Transform is there. You see another tip it up, you see another thing, you say, oh God, this is good, this is good, this is good. People are implementing, yeah. People know how to wash their hands well. People are able now to deal with their hygiene and sanitation. Cleanliness is also part of our health. Like, like they know how to be clean and they know how to avoid some di diseases. Uh, they know how to, to take boiled water. They use not to cook water, they just take from the dams. Children are getting better right now. Right now they even know what to feed their children. They know that it's very important to save money for the future, but when we told them, so they were able to set up small, uh, small savings groups. They are like, oh my God, you opened up my mind. You opened up my mind. I couldn't know that I can save this amount of money just little by little. I have a savings group of over 70 members. So in the first week, these are people who told me that they, could, they had nothing to save. But actually, after some long interactions, house to house visits, we saw that they could save at least 1,000 shillings in a week. We graduated a participant in 15 communities, and uh, so far, people are doing good in businesses, people are saving their money, people have started constructing houses out of the teachings of ICM. Many people uh, expect tangible stuff like money foods and all that, but you target uh, 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 the, their mindsets. I've really appreciated the way ICM does things. They don't give out handouts, but they teach you knowledge, because knowledge is power, so that's great. People are becoming friends. We had a problem of tribalism in some places, but because of Transform, these people have learned to love each other. We can access any family, we can access any home and they will open the doors, they don't release dogs for us anymore. <laughs> Maybe it's something that I'll add on that, thanking the team for their support and whatever they are doing for the mothers in Africa and the children in Africa. I'm excited and happy for their accomplishments, but um, still I, I have that eagerness to achieve more because it is just the beginning. Since many people can go through the program, more lives will be changed because of that. So I pray that the program continues for years and years. the team was able to accomplish here in Uganda 
and my colleagues back in the Philippines are doing amazing work and it makes me so proud. When I go to these communities and meet the participants, I see that they're like me many years ago. So many of them don't have hope. But I am so happy that now I can be the one who is bringing them hope and helping them to transform their lives. I do what I do because I believe that every child should have the opportunity to follow their dreams. What I am now because of the training and development provided by ICM, I am forever grateful to God and to ICF. Because of your generosity, I feel so much empowered to fight against poverty. I am not just existing but now leaving. My life has a purpose because you dreamed with me. I've built a life worth living. Thank you so much. Thank you so much.